In Hawaiian, we have a phrase called ai kame aloa, meaning more so colloquially, use what you have readily available. And in Hawaii, we have a lot of sun, we have a lot of wind, we have a lot of rain, we have a lot of waves, and we have a lot of lava with our volcanoes. <laughs> So it's often said that Hawaii's energy transition is a postcard from the future. We've been really excited that the Kapolei Energy Storage System is actually proving the grid forming technology that's going to be so important to stabilizing the grid in the future. We started working on this project in the beginning of 2018. The idea was to be able to move the island away from coal, add additional renewable energy, and help Hawaiian Electric meet their goal of 100% renewable energy by 2045. And now allows for the sunsetting of one of the dirtiest polluters in our community. So the coal power plant is no more, and partly because of the storage facility that we have today. There are 158 megapacks on this site. That is 185 megawatts, 565 megawatt hours, roughly equivalent to the capacity of the coal plant that was recently retired. This facility is able to power 20% of the electrical need at its peak on the island of Oahu. It turns out despite all the technology we have nowadays, the electric grid is more fragile than what people really expect. Clouds come over, a storm comes through, the wind stops blowing. The grid doesn't adapt to quick changes very well, and so a battery energy storage system can manage those fluctuations, kind of buffer that so it keeps the grid stable and even, and hopefully you don't get the blackout that you would get if that service wasn't there. We worked with Plus Power and Tesla. Together, we're really pioneers in developing this project and incorporating the kinds of grid services that we are benefiting from today. So the incredibly fast response time of Megapacks inverters mean that Plus Power can participate in any kind of market service available. So not just energy shifting or reserve capacity, but providing frequency support or voltage support, keeping the grid balanced on a millisecond basis and that required the battery to operate much more quickly than what a typical battery does or what any traditional power plant will typically do. So the Kapolei Energy Storage System has black start capability, which means when you have a power outage, when all the lights are out, power goes down, it's one of those resources that can help bring it back up. Wherever you put a renewable energy project in place, you're in someone's neighborhood or very close to it. And so having meetings with the community, getting their acceptance, their support is really important to make sure that project can get done. The core value of Plus Power is being excellent partners and members of our community. Development is all about relationships, and we were extremely proud to have the support of local neighborhood 34, as well as the Honolulu Fire Department. So when we had the official meeting for the final vote before the board, in order to actually whether or not recommend the project moving forward or or not, the vote was unanimous. It's very exciting. It's going to be good for Hawaii and all of our communities. It'll be a model for the nation and hopefully for the rest of the world.